Hello folks, the Robozoid here. I was not going to do this video. I swore I would never do this video because it's just opening up a can of worms that I don't think needs to be opened up. But the story is just too big to ignore, even though it's a week old story now. Yeah, and that's about this dopey will convert your children video by the San Francisco Gay Men's Choir. Now, if you're gay, that's your business. If you're a lesbian, that's your business. If you like to do the wingle wangle with your wiener in front of other guys, that is totally your business and I want no part of it. But if you do it in public, and also you say we'll convert children to thinking our way or tolerating us, you're on real dangerous grounds. I know plenty of lesbians, well, mostly lesbians, who will not put up with this sort of thing and basically say this is terrible, this is a bad representation of the LG whatever they are, and also that this is an unfair look at how gays are. And it is an unfair look. After all, gays are just like everybody else. They just want to be loved, they just want to be left alone, and also, they just want silence! Is a little silence too much to ask? Well, I guess I'm going to have to show you this video, what I can show of it anyway, uh, before I completely lose my lunch. All right. You asked for it. You think we're sinful. You fight against our rights. You say we all lead lives you can't respect. But you're just frightened. You think that we'll corrupt your kids if our agenda goes unchecked. Just this once, you're correct. We'll convert your children. Oh, by the way, what is up with that shit-eating grin of his? Seriously, nobody smiles like that. Yes, as one Klingon general said in Star Trek, I don't trust men who smile too much. By the way, uh, I have no plans on ever going to San Francisco, and as far as disco music goes, I hate disco. I really do. I just really hate it. I'm a rock and roll guy. It's times like this, if, if I'd been older in the 70s, I'd feel the same way. I hate disco. Make him wear pleated pants, we don't care. We'll convert your children. Make them tolerant of friends You won't approve of where they go at night To protest Except your pro- If you want to do the swan dive every night into some goat urine and toxified peanut butter Why don't you go do- well go ahead, be my guest, but do not splash any on me And don't get any on any of my grown-up children Yes, my children are grown now I don't have to worry about this But other people? Oh, you watch out. These zombies are coming for your children. And you can't let that happen. For the life of me, I have no idea why anybody thought this was a good idea. The videos jive. I mean, it really is. I mean, I'm not saying that's all full of lies and it's fake and all that. This is very much for real. But it can't be representing the gay community well. Hey, parents of straight kids worry about where they are and where their kids are at night. Nothing new. But you guys with poor fashion sense, man, you guys are just bizarre and sick. Hurt your children, yes we will. Reaching one and all, there's really no escape. Oh, one more thing. Who the hell would want to even visit San Francisco anyway? It's a fucking shithole. By the way, I think it should be noted, 
It's not a good thing for gays to say, we're coming for your children, because quite frankly, that makes you sound like a monster. That just makes you sound like the boogeyman. I mean, really, what a Stalinist thing to do. And is it just my imagination, or does this one guy down here look like George Carlin? Oh, George, where are you? Where are you when we need you, George? Get back here now. Why don't you start caring about justice for me? Maybe I don't want my kids exposed to this. And I know plenty of gay people who don't want to be exposed to this. You're not representing them well. You're making them look stupid, okay? You're making them look Stalinistic. You're making them look, well, you're making them look Stalinistic. You're making them look like, uh, like they're serious, dangerous pedophiles. Do you know how sick you sound when you say, we're coming for your children? You deserve everything you get if that's your attitude. Oh, man. Am I the only one who sees something wrong with this? I know I'm not. Many YouTubers have already pointed out the problems with this. And I'll tell you right now, uh, one of them, I believe it was uh, Sinatra Says, got it totally right. This is Stalinistic. This is just, you know, conversion therapy is just a dangerous thing now. And I don't want to hear about conversion therapy anymore. Especially when you got a bunch of tutti fruities singing, We'll convert your children. We're coming for your children. Creepy. Oh, by the way, am I mistaken or is it so... Or do you not see so much as one black face in here? Eh, they all look mostly like white guys. Well, except for this one dude here. But honest to God... I mean, this also seems racist, too, if you don't have very many blacks in this. Yeah, jeez. You people really need to think this thing through a little better. Uh, is there any more to this garbage? There's nothing wrong with standing by your side, but there's definitely something wrong with standing in front of guys like you. Syncopate! Syncopate, fags! Syncopate! Can't you even do that? All right, turn it off. I've had enough. Well, if there is one saving grace, that is that I have heard that the video has since been pulled from YouTube and is uh, almost impossible for download. And you'll also not be surprised the, the numerous dislikes and backlash that the video received almost immediately. Yes, Christian fundamentalists were attacked mostly for the dislikes, but to tell you the truth, was a lot of gay people who did a lot of attacking of this video, saying it didn't represent them well. And they're right. It doesn't represent gays very well. It makes them look stupid. And is that what you're trying to do? You're just trying to make gays look stupid. I think they're a lot smarter than this. And they're definitely too smart to wear a proud rainbow t-shirt everywhere they go. Quite frankly, I don't even like t-shirts that much. I just prefer tank tops. Keep away from me, guys. I'm, I'm, I'm packed. Oh, well, this has been the Robozoid saying, I'm sorry I put you through this. And if I caused any hurt, suffering, or anguish to, any of the, to anyone in the gay community, you're bringing that on yourself. But to those of you who are like me and against this video, and know that it doesn't represent you well, then you're doing the right thing.